OK, here we're going to look at how to mark essay type questions within a Moodle quiz. So I'm logged in as the teacher and I'm just going to click into my quiz that I want to mark. Rather than going to preview, I want to go to results. Now if I click on the drop down for that, you can see there are several different sections there. What we want to do is to go to manual grading. If you click on the other one, you can get to there eventually from there, but it's faster if we just go directly. Okay, and here we have two grade, we have two students have submitted, and I haven't graded any of these yet. Also note, you can select between the students that you're actually marking or everyone on the course if they've been split up into groups. You'll also see there's a section there for questions that have been graded automatically. If I click on that, you see it adds an extra column here and this is all the multiple choice and other quiz types that have been marked automatically by the computer. Because I'm only interested in a particular piece of this, uh, I'm just going to hide those. I don't want to look at the uh, multiple choice questions at all at the moment. And the question that I'm looking to mark is the data interpretation question. So here it is down at the bottom. Question 1B. The other elements of this data interpretation question have been marked automatically by the computer. This is only showing me the ones that I need to mark uh, because they need additional input from a tutor to decide whether they're accurate. So I'm simply going to go in and click on grade. Here we have the student's answer. And here we have the recommended information for what the student should have put into their answer. I can then provide a comment. And give it a mark. That's the first student's work done for that particular component of the question. I'll then move on to the next student. Then save and go to the next page. All selected attempts have been graded for that particular element of the question. So if I scroll down, here we have it. And you can see that I've already marked two of these and no, none require any additional marking. I can then move to the next question and grade that. And you just work your way through until you've completed all of the assigned essays type questions that you need to mark. And that's it.